Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy back at it again. You already know. Sorry for being, you know, late. It's been like two weeks. I'm sorry about that. We just haven't been consistent recently. You know, your boy's been slacking off. I started school recently. I've been getting homework, new school. You already know how it is, bro. High school life. Yes, sir. But, yup. I'm gonna start uploading now. Sorry about that. This, like, past few weeks, I've just been, like, not, like, focused on YouTube. Like, I had that, like, mentality to just upload, but I was like, nah, like, I'm not gonna upload, you know what I mean? So, yeah, I always wanted to, you know, make a video, but I just didn't know what to upload, or I was just too busy to upload. So, yeah, sorry about that, but, you know, we're back at it again. I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to order from High Coco. So, you know, let's get into it. What you guys are gonna wanna do to search it is just highcoco.org. Oh, shit. What you guys are gonna wanna do is just search up High Coco. And it's gonna be the first link, not this one. This is a fake, as you can see. Yeah, this is just a fake website. You're gonna get scammed. You're not gonna get your shoes. Um, yeah, just don't order from this. I know it looks tempting, like it looks legit, but it's not. So it's always the first one. It's just highcoco.org, not highcoco.co. So we're gonna click on this. And this is the site. Looks pretty good. I never been on it for like a while now, but it looks even better. As you can see, look at these. They got the reverse mochas, they got the fragments. Um, yeah. Yeezys, Dunks, Jordan 1s, Jordan 4s, they got everything. This is um, the JD batch, as you can see. Travis Scott's, Shattered Backboards, Yeezys. Yup. We got some Yeezys from the JP batch. We got some Infrared 4s. We got Ama Manier 4s. We got Motorsports. Like, bro, this is good. And then we got new products. This is all like the new stuff. That Coco just been dropping. Coco's been like hitting it recently. But yeah. So let's say you guys find a shoe that you want. Um, for this example, we're going to go Jordan 1 Mocha. You know, keep it simple. You know. Oh, shit. I, I don't know if they got it, but. Hey, I love mama, would you like to be my sunshine? Nigga, touch my game, we gon' turn this shit to Columbine. But this is literally our last hope. Just so, ch like, this is our last hope to search up Mocha. And let's just see. Yep. Of course, of course, bro. All you do is just search up Mocha, bro. From what I'm thinking, like, if I'm not wrong. <laughs> If I'm not wrong, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm not wrong. Okay, so what you're gonna do is not search up like the shoe because it's gonna say the batch, right? And then it's not gonna show. All you gotta search up is just the name of the shoe. So, you see how these are Jordan 4 breads? You just search up bread. If you're looking for UNC ones, just search up UNC. If you're looking for mochas, just search up mocha, you know? But yeah, they're right here, as you can see. You can take a look at them. They look pretty good. You can zoom in. These are some pictures. This is like a QC of one of the shoes. They look good. As you can see, really good detail. Just an overall, just good shoe. The hourglass is there. It's good. And yeah, also what you could do is just go on Reddit and then look at other people's QCs. Um, for example, just go reddit and then i'm just gonna go rep sneakers i just go on the subreddit rep sneakers search up jordan one mocha coco and then you're gonna see a bunch, a bunch of QCs. This is like reverse mochas, but as you can see, this is one QC from a month ago. This is a real like QC of someone's shoe. 
yeah, these are good in my opinion, but you know, could be wrong. You could check the comments. Toe box could be a bit better, but no reason to red light. This is a green light in my opinion. Yup, this guy green lighted it. They look good to me, size 10. And yeah, when you get, so once you order this and you get your QC, just compare it to, you know, some of these other QCs or post it yourself on Reddit and post your QCs and yeah. I'm going to show you guys how to order. What you guys are going to do is just pick your size. Let's say I'm a size 10 because that's what I am. Add it to cart. And then go to your cart. And, you know, guessing that you guys are new to Coco, you guys don't have an account. So you guys are going to have to make an account. So right here. In the sign in method, well, just right here. You're just gonna put your email, so some random email, like whatever your email is. You're gonna check this off, put your password, you know, whatever you wanna do. And then password, whatever you wanna do. Obviously, I have my own account, but you know, yeah. You're just gonna make your account, put your name, put your last name. You're gonna put your address, so like just put your normal address, your country you're from, your province or you know, state if you're in the US, province if you're in Canada, city, whatever city, your zip code or postal code, and your phone number. Shipping fee, you could either put freight insurance or not. I recommend it because you know, for 10 extra dollars, you could ensure that like. You basically get insurance and no matter what happens to your package, whether it gets seized, gets damaged, you're going to get your money back or get a new shoe, basically. Um, yeah, my friend, he ordered some black hats. He got done dirty and he talked to Coco and Coco just shipped him out a new shoe for literally free, basically. He just had to pay delivery, so 25 bucks for a whole new pair, which is insane. Um, yeah, so you put free insurance, I recommend it. You put check out, check PayPal because I'm guessing you guys are gonna pay from PayPal. You can use Bitcoin if you want. And then here, um, for the discount code, you're just gonna put the discount code, um, that saves you $15. So it's just Coco, this. It saves you um, $15, as you can see. So you literally just get 15 bucks, bro. It's sick. And then you just press place order. And then once you place it, um, I'm going to show you how to talk to them on WhatsApp. All right, guys. So basically, we're on WhatsApp now. Um, um, I'm going to show you guys the old chats that I have with Coco to, you know, just help you guys order. And yeah, just keep it simple. Coco's phone number is just going to be on the screen right now. Um, save it and then talk to them. Just enter that on WhatsApp and start talking to them. And just copy exactly what I do. So after you place your order, you're going to get a confirmation just like this. You're going to get a thank you, your order number, and then, yeah, you're going to get all of that. Coco, they're not going to DM you immediately because they're on the other half of the world. They're on the like opposite end of the world. So, you know, they DM me back at three in the morning. So, you know, I was dead asleep, so I didn't see it. But yeah, Coco here, please confirm. Please send via friends and family and do not mention any brand thing when you make the payment. They just don't want to, what's it called? I'm not honestly 100% sure why they do this. Probably because they don't want to be seen as like a company in PayPal's eyes. Um, you know, either to not get scammed by the customer or just to not get shut down by PayPal because they're selling replica products. So, yeah. And then second, do not mention any uh, website info order. Just remember, do not write anything or else payment will be returned. So, you guys have to have to send this via friends and family and not um, as just a company. Just send it to them as friends and family or else they're just going to give you a refund. So, yeah. They're going to give you their PayPal account and then just send them the money. I sent them the money here. 
succeed. And then I told them my email. And then they tell me your order number, my name, got a QC in five days. I just put a thumbs up. They And then um, just a few days later, just exactly two days later, they gave me my QC. So this is what the QC looks like. This is for the metallic fours. Um, they look pretty good. Yeah. And then this is for the bread fours. As you can see, they look good too. And yeah. I was just too excited and just green lighted them when there is like some flaws, but I didn't even care. But yeah, green light, green light. Both pairs are very nice. Thank you. Could I also get my shipping number when the order is ready? Make sure you guys say that or else you're not going to know what time your package is going to come and you can't track it. So yeah, tracking in four days. Sound good. Thanks. I asked some extra stuff, but yeah, it doesn't matter. They're going to just DM them like a few days later. Just be like, update on tracking. They're going to give you your tracking number but for both of them. Just say thank you, and that's it. You're done. Unless something goes wrong with the delivery process, you're safe, you're good. Put this into a tracking app. I use, what's it called? You can use 17 track. You can use um, Aftership. You can use basically anything. It doesn't matter. But now I'm going to show you guys how to, you know, track your package. Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy on iPhone this time. You already know we on WhatsApp. I'm going to just show you guys real quick how to track your package. What you guys want to do is just copy-paste the tracking number. Um, go to Aftership. Open up a new package. Copy-paste the tracking number. Uh, it's EMS. Um, Cocoa Oil ships with EMS. And, yeah, just title it however you want. Um, we're gonna just title it Hi Coco. And yeah. As you guys can see, it's been delivered. So yeah. Um it's gonna this is all like the updates and shit that I got. Um starting from when Coco shipped it out to when it just came to my front door. And yeah. I mean it didn't even come to my front door. It came, but then it wasn't like available to get delivered, so I had to go pick it up at the post office, which is low key like a bummy move, but it is what it is, and yeah, I'm happy it came. I was happy with it. It's all right. It's an eye right for beginners, but I wouldn't say long term it's worth it. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'm gonna catch you guys next week. You got me jumping like.